Hi Libra, welcome to your love reading. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. We have the Hermit in reverse with the Four of Pentacles in reverse. Definitely there could have been someone who's ghosted you or you could have ghosted them. Take it how it resonates. But someone's coming out of isolation. Someone's gone into within, like this is someone who's gone within themselves, done a lot of soul searching, wanted to get a lot of answers and now someone's come out with an epiphany they've had some kind of a realization some truth has come uh, up in the surface and with the four of pentacles in reverse here i feel someone's releasing the other person okay um it's just that basically if this is you you're there is some kind of truth that has come up okay there's some kind of realization that you have you've got the answers to your questions and the answer is for you to let go of something, okay? To release something, okay? Something that you've been holding on to very tight for a very long time. Something that you've been very attached to, you're letting something go, okay? And it's been after a period of isolation, okay? So there could be no communication. You guys could have been in separation, okay? But yeah, someone who is very, very withdrawn here, okay? Has come to a kind of a realization that they want to let go of something, okay? That no longer... Uh, they deem to be secure, stable, or um, committed. Okay. Let's see. All right. Well, how do you see yourself in the connection, Libra? How do you see yourself in the connection? Give me one more card. You see yourself as the two of wands in reverse with the eight of wands in reverse. So definitely uh, you're not being able to make a decision, okay? You're holding back yourself from making a decision here, okay? With the eight of wands in reverse here, I think that you're holding back communication, okay? Either things are not moving as fast as you want to, but I think this is you holding back, okay? You're trying to block someone out, okay? But um, I think you're not being able to make up your mind. You're unable to choose uh, choose a path you have one foot in one foot out okay could be that you're very focused on your own goals okay rather than the present situation right now but there is indecision okay but uh with the eight of wands in reverse you have because of this indecision right things have come to a complete halt all right something that was moving really fast okay i think you're pulling away and holding back because something's moving very fast probably is what i'm getting at a very fast pace and uh you're wanting to slow things down yeah Either you're ignoring communication, okay, or you're just creating your own delays. I think you're creating your own delays here, but because there is indecision, right? That's why there is this stagnant energy out here, okay? I think you're distancing yourself also, or you're just not communicating. I feel this indecision that's going on within yourself, right, is what is causing this delay here. Things are moving too slow, or they're just completely at a halt. Okay, how does this person see, the, see themselves in this connection? Nine of Cups in reverse with the Three of Wands in reverse. You're dealing with someone who's um, emotionally very, very drained, okay? This is someone who sees you probably as their wish fulfillment, okay? You make them very, very happy. But for right now, this person is very, very emotionally drained. This could be someone, you know, who's very focused on their happiness and which was you. But right now, they are... Um, very upset is what I'd say. This could also be overindulging into alcohol, overindulges on some sort, okay? Because they're just not happy right now and could be in a state of shutdown also. But with the three of wands in reverse here, this person is giving up on something, okay? Probably this person has been waiting on you for, to make a decision, okay? And uh, they're no longer holding on, okay? It makes them, it, it really kills them to wait for you. But now it breaks their heart, okay? They almost thought that you were a wish fulfillment for them. But, and they probably waited for you for a very long time, okay? To make for, make a decision without their giving up. They're turning their back on the situation, okay? But again, with the Nine of Cups in reverse here, this is something that they thought was emotionally very, very fulfilling. But unfortunately, their desires and their needs are not being met out here, okay? Whilst you take your own time to make a decision, okay? And things are, and you're completely blocking communication or delaying the communication, creating on your own, Okay? That's what this person is doing. And that's why with the Hermit in reverse here, I feel... Okay, so now I can get two scenarios here. Either this is you who's completely isolated yourself and now you're coming out of isolation, you know, wanting to return to someone, okay? But by the time this person returns to you, right? Or you return to this person, this person has already let you go, okay? Because this is giving me two scenarios. Or the other thing is that someone has come to some kind of a realization and that realization has led them to let go of another person here. 
We'll see. Let me clarify more. Okay. Let's see. What action will Libra take towards this person? The sun with the five of cups. All right. Look at the yellow. So pretty. So I feel that uh, Libra, this person with the sun here, they want to focus on their happiness, okay? They want clarity, okay? They want some kind of illumination or they've had some kind of illumination, okay? But somewhere, somehow, with the Five of Cups here, there is a lot of regret, okay? The Five of Cups is a lot of, uh, it's a very traumatizing energy, right? Where someone is constantly thinking about what went wrong in the past. So this person, you guys have broken up is what I'm feeling. And this person is constantly thinking and grieving of some kind of loss and regretting whatever breakup happened in the past, okay? This is someone emotionally and energetically affected by this divorce, breakup or whatever it is. They're constantly thinking, wish, wishing things could have been handled differently. Yeah, this is the action. Libra. So now if you're on this side here, this is what you're doing, okay? You're constantly crying over spilt milk. Again, a lot of disappointment in the past, okay? You feel you could have handled things differently is what I'm getting. And with the sun here, you're just uh, wanting, to, you, you're being very positive, okay? I feel you're, you're very contradicted, okay? And that's, see, I get a lot of contradiction out here too, you know? You're, you're wanting forward movement here okay but you're purposely holding back stopping movement okay things are stuck because you're not making a decision you really want to okay you really want to and that's what you're doing so there is no action from your side Libra but I feel it's this person okay so from this person's side I don't see any action being taken out here whilst this person out here is giving up okay because they're fed up and tired of waiting <clears throat> what action will this person take towards Libra what action will this person take towards Libra? Yeah, they don't give a shit to you, Libra. Well, whatever. This person doesn't give a shit to the other person, all right? Three of cups with the six of cups in reverse. This person's not going to take any action towards you, too. Because you've left, whatever you've done, this indecision, this delays, uh, and this holding back communication has left a bad taste in their mouth. They're holding a grudge against you. They're reliving the past, mem past memories, the bad memories, and they're replaying it over and over again, okay? They only look at you, or uh, this relationship, in a very negative light. And with the Three of Cups here, they're not really bothered about whether you're coming back or not because they've given up on you. They're no longer waiting for you. Although it is something that they really wished for once upon a time, they're no longer waiting for you, okay? And that's what I was getting as the overall energy, right? With a hermit in reverse and the four of pentacles in reverse. That's what I said in the beginning. Someone has come to some kind of a realization and they're releasing something, okay, that they were holding on to. So, yeah, there's one person here who was holding on to the other person for a very long time, hoping that they will make a decision. But because there was another the person here who did not make a decision, they held on to communication, they blocked communication, or they were just creating the delays on purpose, trying to buy time, and they were indecisive, okay? So the other, other person has walked away. This person is walking away, all right? More than walking away, they just don't really care, all right? They're enjoying themselves, having fun, chilling with their girls, you know, like whatever. They're partying, enjoying, chilling. They don't really, they're not really bothered anymore. All right, I'm going to tell you how it is. Whilst the other person out here is still crying over spilt milk, have a lot of regret. Again, like I said, things could have been handled. A lot of could have, would have, should have kind of energy. With the sun here, this person out here does want clarity. But well, I guess they'll have to just hurry up a little. All right, Libra, how does this person, how do you view this person? How does Libra view this person? Six of Wands in reverse and the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Libra, you view this person as uh, someone who's just not putting in the effort, not putting in the work, and uh, no longer working on this connection, okay? Although they, you could have been someone who was, um, the, the person that you're dealing with, this person out here could have been someone who was constantly focused on the relationship, okay? Constantly wanting to make the relationship work, okay? And uh, the, the, the second person out here, right? This person could always been wanting uh, to put a label on this connection, you know, they would be wanting forward moment here, they would be wanting public recognition. But now, the way you view this person is someone who's just not giving you the attention, not putting in any work, no effort, not even working on this connection anymore. And there is this uh, uh, this uh, feeling of um, 
something that failed okay there is this disappointment out here but this person you view this person as someone who's just make who's ignoring you not giving you the attention and uh you know making you feel uh just neglecting you okay or ignoring you that's how you view this person here i think this is a cross what you're reading but anyways that's just how just take whichever side resonates all right how does this person view libra Okay, we got three cards we'll take it king of pentacles death and the magician in reverse um this person views you as someone who is very very focused on your career your goals your money your stability your security okay someone who is uh with doing everything that they can okay to hold back okay and withholding communication trying to tame your emotions okay this person sees you as someone who's just doing their best to stay away from them okay but the king of pentacles here this person could be viewing you as someone who's got their shit together okay for sure someone who's very stable secure they could also view you as someone that they would they wanted some, something long term or they would still want something long term and committed with you right but with the magician in reverse here they do view you as someone who's very very manipulative someone who's got a very self-serving energy you know someone who's constantly got a trick under their sleeves you know and they're constantly trying to play a trick lying cheating wearing a false mask okay so that's how they view you libra they know you're holding back all right and uh, they could also see you as someone who's more of uh, more materialistic and more focused on the earthly matters and more focused on the materialistic aspect of life not overly doing it but i think with the king of pentacles they do see you as someone they want something long term with okay but at the same time you you're being very manipulative and that's how they see you with the magician in reverse here you know you're wearing a false mask <clears throat> is how they view you um <clears throat> let's see let's see i'd like to see is what are what are the blockages in this connection what is blocking this connection is what i'm getting if you know someone also you know someone who does things for their personal gain okay at the expense of others you know you do things solely for your own benefit i mean that's what the magician in reverse is right So yeah, they do view you again, wanted something long term with you, okay, that's how they see you, but um, yeah, they do see you as someone who's got their shit together, you got your money together, very stable, very secure, right, but you're holding back for some reason, and you're playing games with them, probably is how they view you, whilst this person views you as someone who's just no more longing, no, no longer putting in the effort, okay, alright, let's see, what are the blockages, what is blocking this connection? What is blocking this connection? The world in reverse here. Yeah, so someone's repeating the same shit. You know, the world in reverse is um, repeating negative cycles, someone not learning their lessons, okay? And um, um, <clears throat> it's like, you know, something's not done, okay? But the problem here is that there are some karmic cycles or some patterns which are being repeated over and over and over again, okay? Someone is literally avoiding uh, or refusing to close out a negative pattern, okay? What's the world in reverse here? <clears throat> Give me one cut the world in reverse. Yeah, three of swords here, which is causing a lot of heartbreak and heartache out here, okay? Someone needs to probably get over, I'm getting, you know what? I'm, I'm, I'm getting two scenarios. Someone needs to get over some past emotional trauma or past emotional distress, okay? Because we have the five of cups here, okay? Maybe in the past or maybe right now. Someone needs to get over some kind of uh, heartbreak or heartache which happened in the past. Until this person doesn't recover and heal, they're going to constantly tear apart any single person who comes towards them, okay? So I'm getting till this person isn't healed, whether a male or female, okay? Till they're not healed, they are going to continue and repeating the same cycle, okay? Which is going to again it's going to traumatize anyone who comes across them and that's the biggest blockage out here someone needs to close out a cycle and start a new cycle but close out a cycle because they're not learning their lessons someone just tends to go back to doing the same thing over and over again okay <clears throat> which is 
not leading to a new beginning okay someone needs to release and surrender okay for, and be ready for something new but this is just not happening because they're just not letting a cycle end okay and whatever this has to do it's it's causing a lot of heartbreak heartache but i feel this has to do with some kind of emotional trauma or some kind of huge breakup separation divorce that happened in the past that has affected this person out here okay all right what is the immediate future for this connection The Empress in reverse and the Three of Pentacles. Hmm. Wow. There is definitely someone here, okay, uh, who's coming towards you, okay? They're wanting to work towards you, okay? They want to work towards a partnership. They want to get on the same page with you, work and build together. And uh, this is someone who's ready to comp compromise, cooperate, okay? They want to they wanna redo things. They want to build and start slow, but they want to develop something very, very uh, solid. But with the, uh, with the Empress in reverse here, I feel there is the other person here who's just not ready to put in the effort. Someone's not ready to put in the effort. They're not wanting to nurture this, nurture this connection anymore. Someone's just fed up of putting in their energy, okay? Someone feels something is a waste of time and there is no growth and expansion here, which is why one person is wanting to work towards this and the other person is like, screw you. This is just not happening. This is a situation that's going nowhere. Okay. So please do expect someone coming towards you wanting to reconcile with you. It's going to be up to you, but I have a, I have a doubt that you would want to make this happen. Okay. I, I don't think you're wanting this anymore because you're already giving up. Okay. You're already giving up here. So whatever it is, right, expect this, okay, and you're not putting the work, they're very aware of that, okay, they definitely know you not wanting to move forward with them, things were disappointing with them, okay, and now, I feel this person is very soon going to make a decision here, okay, that's when they're coming in to want to work towards you, but I think you're, something's, you're just reliving the past memories, the past pain over and over again, which is why, like I said, four of pentacles in reverse here, right? Either this is someone who's coming out of isolation and by the time they come back, like you're releasing this person here. The other story I'm getting is with the hermit in reverse and four of pentacles here, that there is someone who's coming back, coming out of isolation, okay? I do get isolation for sure. Someone who's isolated you, withdrawn, ghosted. Someone's coming out of that energy here, wanting to talk okay and they're releasing whatever they were holding back so this could be someone who you're dealing with who's coming out of the out in the open coming back to you okay who ghosted you and if they were holding back they're ready to open up okay whilst they're ready to open up you're let it, ready to let it go but I, i'm getting a lot of scenarios okay so take what resonates so that's what i have for you libra i hope this reading resonates with you if it does do like share subscribe leave your comments below like share subscribe and i will see you next time